Hey, hey Pisces, welcome on my channel, Triple Two Tarot. I'm going to do your bonus January 2021 general love reading. Who is coming towards you? How are they feeling towards you? What are they bringing? And what are their messages towards you? So let's figure it out, Pisces, together. Who is coming towards you in love? Keep in mind, this is a general reading. So take what resonates with you and leave the rest if something is not resonating. It's mean this is not for you. This message is not for you. You can find out any other channel who can you resonate with. Um... Uh, you can get a personal reading from me if you want it. Check out the description box for all the personal reading. Uh, you can also uh, join me on Instagram for more fun. Okay? Sun, moon, rising, any planets if you have in Pisces, you can watch this reading. So this is the after love tarot. So let's see who is coming towards you and what do they want to say to you and how are they feeling for you if you're already dealing with someone. Let's see. Bonus reading for my Pisces. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe my channel. Four of Wands. Ooh. 1111. Mm. You could be seeing a lot of 1111. This is your soulmate. This is your twin flame. We have the Page of Pentacles. So someone sees your value. Someone sees your worth. Someone finally know that you are the one Pisces. Wow. This is a commitment offer. Our offer. Offer that will make you happy. I'm hearing yeah, Five of Cups, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. We have the Five of Wands, a lot of fire. We will see. We will see. Who is this person? This is someone, Seven of Pentacles. Okay, they're coming. They're coming out of this, this, this thinking and planning. They're coming. We have the six of swords yeah they're coming they're coming out of this this sh they're coming out of this show five of swords a lot of five triple five already so you could be seeing five five a lot chariot reverse cancer okay let's see who is this person pisces we have the ten of pentacles ow 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 Page of Swords reverse here. Hmm. So we have the Hierophant. We have the Three of Cups, bottom of the deck, and Magician. Okay. Uh, and we have the Nine of Pentacles, by the way. So this is someone who is single, but I feel this is you, Pisces. Mm -mm. You're doing your own stuff. Eight of Cups. Uh, I also saw the Eight of Cups, by the way. Bottom of the deck, we have Eight of Cups. This is someone that you left, and you're doing your own work. Yeah. You said, no, I have to go. I have to definitely move on from you. We need a break. You took a break from this person or you just detach for yourself when you put your time on yourself in the nine of pentacles and now when you are shining and glowing this person sees this shine and glow in you and they say here is my pisces she's the one or he's the one whoever you are watching this this is not gender specific bottom of the deck we also have nine of cups we have a lot of nines here so you could be seeing a lot of nines now this person is tired this person was playing mind games with you. They're really, really attractive to you because now you are shining, you're glowing, and you you definitely put this person on the space, okay, in their place. Like, what do you think? I will always be here and begging to you, like, love me, come to me, come to me, and you never give me this nine of cups, even though I wanted to be with you, I wish to be with you, but you did not give me that. So I'm moving on. I left, okay? So you left them or they left you, whatever. But definitely no contact situation. This is someone that um, who took a break from you because of the finances or you took a break. Like, no, it's not serving me. This is not good for me because I'm not happy in this. So I have to take a break. I have to focus on myself. Now, when you are doing your own things and you're being happy and you're doing your own things and manifesting abundance and success in your life and they're seeing that you are you level up okay and you are leaving them behind and they are definitely not taking it nine of swords they're not taking it they're not admitting that what they did okay this is their demons okay they're up at night and over obsessive and thinking about you because they feel like you are theirs why because you were there um, to give them the, this cup this love and now when you're not giving them and you may be choosing someone else or maybe you know deciding to move on and this person is like no you're mine pisces you can't do that so this person is definitely have some serious issues um i will talk about this later but definitely this is a reading here now we have the this is someone uh with the five of cups five of swords and five of wands all these fives so you could be seeing five five a lot 
Whenever you're seeing this, it means that this person is definitely thinking about you. This person definitely left you in the cold. They ignored you um, or, you know, the five of wands. You could have a fight with this person. This person always bring the drama in your life. Or they could have a choices, but they choose someone else over you. Now, with the five of swords, this person is like, hey, I'm winner. I finally win it, okay? And this person was also very egoistic, like they were not letting you in, okay? They were not letting you in. So you said, okay, I feel like this is like a story. So with the six of swords, you said, okay, fine. So if you're not here to work with me and talk with me and you're, you're feeling like you're the winner, okay. So go and win. You are the winner. I'm taking my, uh, my offer. I'm taking my time to somewhere else. And I will put this offer and this work into myself rather than on you because it's nothing. It's nothing moving forward. I'm not getting anything from you. So with the chariot energy reverse here, um, this person is stuck on you. Even though you moved on from this person and maybe vice versa, Pisces, this is your energy. Like you are having a difficult, they left you and you are having a difficult time to move on from this person because we have the chariot reverse. Someone is stuck here. Someone is not moving forward. And also this is a heavy spying going on. This person is heavily spying on you or vice versa. Again, this is maybe your energy. Like you are having a difficult time to believe that this person left you and you are heavily spying on this person on social media. And this is making you more stuck on this person. Okay. Now, what I'm seeing here with the Ten of Pentacles, for some of you, this could be someone that your family involved or children involved with this person, because I'm seeing here, this is a woman here, like taking the child with her and she's like, okay, I'm, go I'm, I'm moving on. Or maybe this is someone that you have a baby with, okay? And that's why you're having a difficult time, but it's not the case. I'm seeing with the Ten of Pentacles, there was a maybe family involved or this person was definitely choose their money, their finances or their family over you, okay? And now, but I'm also seeing with the Four of Wands and Ten of Pentacles, this is someone that they feel like you are the one for them, that they can have a good time with you, they can have a family with you, they can create a future with you. Um, because Page of Pentacles, now they see the value in you. Because you're growing up, you're glowing. You're glowing, you're glowing, you're glowing, you're glowing, and they're heavily spying on you. They can't, they can't ex admit that what they lost. And they're still feeling like you are theirs. I don't know, whoever this person is, they're really, really obsessed with you. I feel like with the Nine of Cups, you're making yourself happy. You're doing your own things. Pisces, this is your energy. To be honest, I would not lie here. I feel this is you. You're heavily um, doing your own work. You're making yourself happy. You're glowing with the self-love. You're shining. You're doing your own things because you left this person behind. You said, no, I'm not getting anything from you. And this person is definitely obsessing over you. They don't want to admit because of their ego, like they left you. They're still in this ego. They're in this battle, okay? And they're heavily spying on you. Um, now they wish to be with you. They want to have a family with you because they feel like you are the one. I don't know, Pisces, you will accept them or not. But I'm seeing with the magician, a lot of you, you are manifesting this person. You see them, your ideal partner, because we have the magician here. So this is someone who is also a manipulator. They know that you're waiting for them. But they, were, they definitely play mind games with you. They ignored you. They did not. Did they maybe did, um, definitely said something harsh to you, like very egoistic thing, like very selfish way, like you know what Pisces. Never, no matter what, you will come back to me. So this is that person with a magician energy. They could be a manipulator. They know that how to get you back because this is someone who is your friend, or you. This person put you in a friend zone with a three of cups. This person feel like you are there, and they're coming to celebrate with you. Yeah, I don't know, you will you will be with them or not, but I'm seeing the Three of Cups and the Hierophant and this all celebration card here. Uh, Pisces, you're going to, a lot of you, you're going to reconcile or celebrate with this person because uh, you definitely intentionally move on from this person because you really wanted to give this person um, a chance. You really wanted to show them that what they're doing wrong. You detach yourself from this. So this is all talking about marriage, celebration, you know, finances, engagement. Hierophant is a marriage card. Three of Cups, celebration. Uh, Ten of Pentacles, marriage, commitment. Four of Wands, commitment, happy reunion. Page of Pentacles, this offer is coming. So a lot of you, this person is going to apologize what they did to you because they did not see your value and now they see your value. Ten of Pentacles, they really want to invest in you. They really want this union with you. They really want to make a home, family, children. Um, and marriage, they really want, I'm seeing with this here, the Hierophant is, you know, because this is after tarot deck, love after tarot deck. So this is like, they, they want to sign a contract with you, like forever. They want to make you there forever. Three of Cups is a celebration. So a lot of you, it's definitely a celebration. 
Uh, and for others, if this could be brand new person, because when you are shining and glowing, you could be manifesting anything. Okay, there's a lot of people that are attracting to you. And now you have a choice maybe uh, to be with this person or to be with someone else. Because I'm, I'm strongly feeling this could be someone um, from your past is coming. We also have new love wedding. Yeah. Wow. I'm definitely feeling a lot of Pisces this year, 2021. You're, going not, you're not going to be single anymore. You're going to in a commitment or marriage. Or I would say you will be in a relationship. Um, stay optimistic about your love life. Yeah, a lot of you, you're being positive because now you know that you deserve love. You deserve equal love. And if you are stuck on someone, so this is your reading telling you that you need to move on from this. If you will not do that, definitely you're not going to get what you want. Yeah, a lot of you, you separate yourself from this person and you are in separation, but you're really positive. Yeah, keep an open mind. So you're really open-minded that whatever is coming to me, I will receive it. Codependency reverse here. So yeah, a lot of you, you're definitely done with this codependent relationships. you understanding finally, Pisces. I really, really appreciate you because you guys are really intuitive and psychics. You know that. Uh, codependency reverse, you finally wanted to be in a relationship that is equal give and take. Making the effort reverse. Yeah, you're not making effort the, toward anyone. So some of you, you could be married with this person. And you took your children with yourself and you just moved on from this person because it was toxic. This was a toxic relationship. No, does not matter. It's a marriage or you were married with this person. You were living together or you were single or you were in a situation. You definitely, you, you just took your energy, your time, like I'm done. Yeah, and this is how this person is feeling now. Unrequited love. This was unrequited love. You separate yourself from that. You felt no, it's not equal give and take and I'm done with this. And now they're feeling it. Whatever they did to you, they're feeling it. I'm feeling. We also have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation. Yeah, this person really want to come in. They really want to talk to you. Getting to know each other, heart-to-heart -heart conversation. They are coming, Pisces. This could be someone new who wants to get to know you because they really want to. They're really attractive to you. Now, let's see who is this person. And then I will check out their messages towards my Pisces. Let's see. We have Cassettes. This is someone who is definitely can't you know playing the same thing in their mind what they did to you they can't get out get over you i feel like they're they're definitely missing that time that when you were with them paradise yeah and we also have the twin flames oh i said 11 11 and we have the twin flames so a lot of you could be dealing with your twin flame or maybe your twin flame is entering in your life yeah, who knows, right? Who knows? Maybe you're going to be with your twin flame. And this is looks like a paradise, obviously. Twin flame is a paradise. Or maybe this is soulmate because I would not say everyone is in twin flame. But love is coming, Pisces. Be open. Receive this love. You deserve this. You've gone through hell. We have the ex, breakup, separation. So a lot of you, you're going to release your ex and you're going to be in love with someone who is um, for you. Coffin, it's a rest in peace. So this could be a Scorpio. So a lot of you, you're dealing with the ex like, I'm done. I'm ready for new. I, I really want my paradise. Or this could be someone that you're done. You just moved on and they're coming back for this union. Yeah, Phoenix, you're rising. A lot of you, you're rising. You don't want to go back there. But this person is coming to speak up their truth, finally. They're going to express their love to you. This is someone who is chasing you now because the tables are turns. But you're happy, Pisces. And I hope that you're in a happy place. So let's see what is their messages towards you. The hidden truth. What do they want to say to you, Pisces? Let's see. This card flew up. I feel you're leaving me behind. Yes, this is someone from the past that you're leaving behind. Because you you know that, what you want and you deserve. Maybe your true tune flame, your soulmate is entering in your life. The person that you thought is maybe your soulmate or lover is not the one. We have. I know I was a distraction from your pain. I wish things could be different. Yeah, this is definitely a past person. That they're regretting it. There's a strong regret here. I wish I could share my good news with you. Oh, really? We both know I am not the one for you. Yeah. This is not the one that was coming to you because I feel like a lot of you, you're not going to choose this person because this person hurt you. And now they see your value. We have sometimes I stay awake thinking about you. I told you, nine of swords. They can't sleep. There's a, this is a heavy regret. This is someone from your past. They have a heavy regret. The way they treated you, they did not accept your offer. Uh, they, they know that. They know that. We have, I left you before you could leave me. Yeah, this is someone definitely was not present there emotionally. 
we have i can't stop thinking about this person is heavily thinking about you they also have the fear and insecurity like you're going to move on and you are already i feel the timing just was not right for us yeah this person was definitely not available emotionally i wish i had treated you better you should honey for some of you it's too late because you're not going to accept this person and you're going to be with someone that who will give you equal give and take and you really want to be with your true soulmate and twin flame someone who can make you happy someone who can be you know give you commitment and you're not not settling less than that and for others of you you thought this is your soulmate and twin flame but it's not okay for i'm also seeing that this if this is your twin flame or soulmate because only you know that you want to hell Okay, and now this person is coming to apologize and want to make things right between you and them and want to offer you this commitment and marriage and you can see that their action, their efforts, then this is for you, that you're going to reconcile and reunite with this person because they are regretting it, that what they did to you. But if someone is not regretting and they're coming for apologize just to, just to make a drama and mess up with you, even though you have someone else or you can be with someone else, this is all up to you again, Pisces, that you want to be with this person or not. So this is your reading. I really hope it resonated. I will see you in the next video. Like, share, and subscribe. Bye. Love you all.